Good afternoon. So I uh, had the camera out the other day and that was working on the shed. Well, it died. So I'll show that now. trying to finish it up because if you were in my live chat today, which was this Monday, you would know we got a bottle baby. Well, as coincidence would have it, it is Matt's cousin that we bought the goats off of. And then she offered us another one. So we have two boar, full blood boar bottle babies and one little my, one little Milo. But but other than that, I wanted to show you guys the uh, two newest born additions to the farm. I have been watching her like a hawk all day, knowing that she's about to give birth. And look, I go to pick Wyatt up and come back home. And that she's got two little twins. They look just like her. How awesome is that? She did it all by herself. Baby goat. And if you look down here, past the blue jacket, that's her babies. And they are absolutely adorable. A little boy and a little girl. The boy's the one with the big white spot on his side. And proud mama. Now this guy with the blue jacket on, that's Audrey, our niece's show goat, and he's going to be made into Cabrito soon, which um, you might want to look up what Cabrito is. That is his intended purpose. And over there, let's see if you can see what I'm doing. There's Mama Goat's baby. Now the only goat left to kid actually is Reba, the grown goat out there. Excited about her. So, as, as you know, Milo is Dolly's, which is the white goat. Mama goat has one. Well, Sandy, the little white goat, she actually aborted her babies the other day. It's kind of a sad deal, but it's there's not anything you can really do about it. Um, it they either it's a spontaneous abortion. I'm trying to figure out what it is because I had two. They were born the same year. And honestly, they're probably just gonna be calls, so they'll be going down the road or into the freezer. That's their intended purpose here. If they can't produce livestock, then they're not worth feeding. But anyway, I don't really want to get into that with you guys. I know you don't want to hear it. So I'm going to show you something else that we got on the farm. There's a, a pig too many, and that's because that's a show pig, that one there. And his show season is done, so he's he's belongs to our uh, Matt's brother and sister-in-law, and we're going to help him butcher him. <laughs> it's kind of exciting. We have all these. What are you saying? Huh? What are you saying? We have all these plants. Oh, really? We have all these plants, and then now we've got uh, other people who are with us on our plans. Like, uh, I've got a friend that's going to start who wants to raise some meat birds, or asked if we would help raise some meat birds with her. Um, so that's three of us families that's going in together for meat birds and me and that friend are also going in together for some lady hens and chicks so it's there's lots of things that's coming to fruitation this year that 
it's a long time coming. I never expected it, honestly, to happen. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, this year. It's just like out here in the garden. There's so many expansions that we're going to do. I guess so many. I'm gonna add that big bed on that side. I'm gonna add another big bed against the house for okra. And uh, then that little three by six uh, platform there is going to be turned into a shed. So things are happening pretty fast this year for me. It's almost a little scary, honestly, but it's so worth it. We've worked hard to get to where we're at, and now look at where we are. Matt's just about finished with the, that third side, then he's got the front and the roof. We've got all the framing done on the inside for the walls. You know, things, things are working out in a big way for us this year. God's blessed us, and that's truly, truly what it is. We were blessed to be able to do these things and have these things this year, and we wouldn't be anywhere without God, for sure. So, <laughs> that being said, thank you guys for watching today. I sure hope you enjoyed it. So, uh, we'll see you soon, guys. God bless.